search teams have spotted debris at sea in the hunt for missing AirAsia flight QZ8501, Indonesian officials say. Several objects and a body were seen floating in the Java Sea off the Indonesian part of Borneo, in one of the search zones for the plane. An Indonesian official said the debris was 95% likely to be from the missing aircraft. The Airbus A32200, carrying 162 people from Surabaya in Indonesia to Singapore, disappeared on Sunday. The search operation is now in its third day, with the area widened to cover 13 zones over land and sea. During a news conference by the head of the operation, shown live on Indonesian TV, pictures of the debris were shown including a body floating on the water. Relatives of passengers on the plane watching the pictures were visibly shocked. AirAsia CEO Tony Fernandez tweeted to the families, My heart is filled with sadness for all the families involved in QZ8501. On behalf of AirAsia my condolences. Search operation head Bambang Slistio said he was 95% certain the objects shown were from the plane adding that a shadow was spotted underwater which appeared to be in the shape of a plane. All resources were now being sent to the area where the debris was found, and all objects or bodies found would be taken to Pangkalan Bun, he said, referring to a nearby town in central Kalimantan province. Mr. Slistio added that ships with more sophisticated technology were being deployed to check whether larger parts of the plane were submerged beneath the debris. Indonesian civil aviation chief Joko Majidmado, quoted by AFP news agency, said significant things such as a passenger door and cargo door had been found. He added that the objects had been found 160 kilometers, 100 miles, southwest of Pangkalan Bun. At least 30 ships, 15 aircraft and 7 helicopters joined the operation when it resumed at 6 o'clock local time on Tuesday.